Hello my dear students welcome to Baidu's exam prep hope you guys are fine so guys in today's video i'll be telling you what are the books you have to refer if you are planning to give gate through environmental science okay so we'll have a quick look with the author the publication and the subjects for which you have to refer the book so let's quickly start it without any delay first of all you can go through my profile if you have visited the channel for the first time talking next you can join my telegram group for further upcoming classes for knowing that for the pdf of this class and for each and everything next coming further let's talk about the book so guys this is the book for environmental chemistry i guess you guys have gone through the syllabus so just like if you talk about civil syllabus mechanical electrical any syllabus there what happens is you have been given what a subjects okay so similarly here various subjects are there and that in depth content is there that okay this subject these these things you have to study this subject these 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 things you have to study similar goes for environmental science and engineering here if i talk about fundamentals of environmental chemistry this by manhan sc this book is a good book you can refer to it by stanley sir uh, this book is good if you are planning to give paper through environmental science and for covering environmental chemistry this is a good book talking next again chemistry for environmental engineering by mcgroyle publication this is also a good book okay i have attached the photo of the books also for you guys so that if you are purchasing or if you are thinking for it so you can go through this books okay you can check the contents which is being mentioned in the internet also talking about microbiology portion environmental microbiology by by this uh, mayer rm pepper there are a number of authors here so this is also a good book uh, but this is for microbiology so i have told you for environmental chemistry now we have uh, subjects of microbiology also in environmental science so for that you can refer to this book next there is one more book brock biology of microorganisms by pearson publication you can refer to this book as well okay now talking next uh, we have engineering hydrology also included in it so engineering hydrology evergreen one book which everybody will tell you to refer is by k subramania mcgroyle publication okay so this is also a good book even i can say the best book for engineering hydrology fine next coming for the fluid mechanics here uh, everybody has a different taste palette taste palettes in a sense oh, obviously you don't have to eat but ye ki uh, the language which has been mentioned the author tries to explain so there are like fashionable english and sometimes you are very much comfortable in the normal english okay so uh, the taste can differ in this so i'll tell you two three different books you can choose based on your choice so fluid mechanics fundamentals and applications by mcgroyle publication you can refer to this next <coughs> excuse me uh talking about modi and said this is the book which i personally like it this i have it also i love this book so this book also you can refer for fluid mechanics next coming further again there is one book, uh, book where i have heard the students review they are like very much fascinated to this book uh, by philip j pritchard fox and mcdonald's introduction to fluid mechanics so this is also a good book according to the students review okay now talking next we have environment also obviously we have environmental chemistry we have microbiology we have fluid mechanics we have engineering hydrology similarly we have water supply engineering so the best book which i can say will be sk gar if you talk about if you want to learn the things from the basics so this book uh, book is pretty good one thing only guys check the publication because certain uh, like codal provisions have been updated so if you are using the previous edition so obviously the codal provisions will not be updated in that book so kindly check it out okay talking about waste water engineering waste uh, even for raw water engineering there is a book of pv and ro you can refer to that also talking about waste water engineering metcalf and eddy this is also a good book again by mcgroyle publication you can refer to it okay similarly if i talk about environmental pollution control engineer because if you see the syllabus there is environmental pollution control engineering also so this book by cs rao is also a good book okay talking about air pollution see if you talk about sk garg in sk garg air pollution is there but if you want to study in depth and separately then you can go by flangen rc and seal wilsers book fundamentals of air pollution engineering 
Similarly, you can also go through a book by Andy Nevers. This is also a book for air pollution control engineering. So I'm giving you a combination of two, three books as much as possible. Some subjects I'll give you, I'll just suggested you one book because that was more than sufficient. Like I told you, Hydrology, K. Subramaniam Sir's book. That's too good. But some books like this is also good. This is also good. So you can't say which one to give more weight. So that's why I've included both of them. Okay, so don't think that ma'am, some uh, sub, uh, some subjects you are telling only one book, some some topics you are telling two different books because both are good. So I can't say that I can't pick only one. Okay. Next, coming for the sewage disposal and air pollution engineering. This is the part two of SK Gar. First was uh, raw water supply or water supply engineering. Second one is wastewater and air pollution. Air pollution is included in this. However, I have told you to separate books for air pollution as well. Okay, so you can refer to any one, whatever you want. Talking about solid waste management. So solid waste management by Springer is also been available. So you can go through this book here. The principles, practices are being told to you, are being explained in detail. Okay, so this will help you. Last is the principles of environmental science again by McGraw-Hill publication is also the this is also a good book a good book talking about the applications parts and all so you can refer to this books also some uh, books will be available to you online also some books you have to I guess every book will be available to you online but two three books I was uh, not able to see actually uh, they were not available in India they were saying it uh, they were out of stock but uh, i guess if you want to purchase check it out on daily basis or you can refer to the local market available but if you are planning for environmental science but you don't know the source you can refer to these books okay so that's all for today guys and if you have any doubts do message me in my telegram group and thank you everybody